Vision of a New World by Dr. Greer Hold one another's hands and see that there is a perfect circle of light form. Feel the deep peace within us and the silentness and quiet. In your inner sight become aware that there is a trans-dimensional interstellar craft that is around us and we are within it. There are extraterrestrial beings meditating with us and we see this beautiful ring of light as we hold one another. Interspersed among us are ET life forms, shifted beyond the crossing point of light, and they are holding hands with us. As we go together into this pure state of silence, we see deep within each of us a fountain of pure light, consciousness made into light. It rises up through our chakras, empowered by the light of the earth and the power of Gaia, and it reaches our heart level and then it rises up to our crown chakra and it bursts forward, upward, into the space above us. It makes a perfect column of light. First, each of us individually project these columns, and then our columns blend into one, and this light goes from left to right around the circle and becomes one massive beam of celestial light going upward into space, piercing the stratosphere. This light spreads out, our light and the goodness within the earth and humanity, and for our full potential of enlightenment spreads from this space to every star, every galaxy, and every intelligent life form in the cosmos. We ask the great spirit that is infinite and boundless to facilitate this beautiful light as a beam going upward, to be a guide for civilizations capable of interstellar travel to come to this place on earth. Ultimately we see this beam of light enter into a vast interstellar centre. It is thousands of miles in diameter in deep space. This is where the ambassadors from other civilizations gathered for millions of years, a time immemorable. We see that they behold us clearly, even as in our own mind we see them. We ask them that they join us here and in their thought essence they do. We see that they are sending back through us a cosmic light coming from the zenith to the heavens into this beautiful circle of people and through us to the earth and the earth rings like a bell. With the resonance of this cosmic light it reaches every man, woman and child on earth and they see a new vision of a new world manifesting from within us into the physical earth. We ask the great spirit that for every man, woman and child on earth that their heart and mind and their essence and spirit be awakened to the people and to the simple truth that are one people in the cosmos and it is time for us to enter universal civilization and endless peace. We see all the secrets that have been held from humanity unveiled, the wondrous technologies that could turn the earth into a rose garden of peace and abundance brought forward for the good of humanity. We see all those forces on earth that are retrograde or resisting this transformed by the nature of this vision. Now we behold this light becoming stronger and we see crystallized in our minds and our vision a new world. It will be an endless and unbroken time of peace for hundreds of thousands of years. While first it can be an eternal peace, the reality is that it will evolve into the age of enlightenment and in the passage of time every child born on earth will be born in cosmic consciousness and hence evolve in God's consciousness and universal unity consciousness. As humanity evolves in this fashion we see that we become ambassadors to other planets spreading enlightenment from earth as an enlightenment has been brought to earth by the ancient ones before us. Our hearts are filled with joy at this vision and we ask that the Great Spirit assist us in making it so and we invite these interstellar civilizations patiently awaiting our arrival to assist us as we vow to assist them. The 
children on earth will be the empty points for the channel to which this knowledge and vision and reality manifests on earth. And so we ask the great spirit that this beautiful time, which we know in our hearts is the destiny of humanity be brought forward. We dedicate ourselves with one another and with the earth and with space and with all these visitors, our brothers and sisters of every star system to create a new world. And we see that it is actually already born within the realm of ideas and it is already to be made manifest, requiring our action. So with some effort on our part, assisted by the great being, the unseen realms and the spirit world, and these interstellar civilization, what seems impossible becomes inevitable. We will see it made manifest within our lifetime, and our hearts are filled with love and joy at the vision of the new world. Namaste.